Hello everyone and welcome back to Everyday Husband Quotes, the channel for marriage advice, marriage entertainment, and everything else, marriage. Hey, hey guys and welcome, welcome back to the channel. Well, over the weekend, Martel and his youngest son's mother, Arion, had a small getaway, honey. And I believe it was actually a date night for the two. They actually were hanging out together and it looks like they were out of town at some type of concert. And you can say that Ariane was on cloud nine to say the least, honey, because she was front and having a good time. Like that's her man. But just a couple of weeks ago, if you can remember, Ariane put a post on social media that said she was feeling away and wanted to no longer be here. She did address that concern over the weekend as well and said this after someone asked her about it and said that she was feeling that way, but it was not because of Martel. She said that Martel ain't never left her side. Now for several seasons, Ariane has been trying to get a spot on Love and Marriage Huntsville and become part of the cast. It's been said out of Melody Holt's mouth that nobody is coming on the show that she doesn't want on there. Carlos King even spoke to the Jasmine brand and told that social media interviewer that he respects his cast and will never put anyone on the show just for the sake of it. I don't know if you can. So let's talk about this other woman. There's been mention of her uh, plenty of times and we know there's a baby. He has a boy. So congratulations to them. Is there any plans of this other woman revealing herself in the show? Because I kind of want to... Like, I, I feel like, and it depends on her personality, but I feel like she should have some time to at least, you know, defend herself or, you know, mm -hmm. explain or have her say. Is there, has there been any talks? Listen, one thing about Love and Marriage Huntsville and the shows that I produce, I follow the reality, right? I follow what my cast members are willing to give. Mm -hmm. I'm not the type of producer who um, goes behind my cast members back and reveal somebody that they had no idea was going to appear. I don't operate that way. Mm -hmm. um, not, no shade to those who do, that's just not my blueprint. So my answer to that is it would have to be something that the collective would want to do, you know, and then it's a conversation. You know, for okay. example, you know, Maurice, ex-wife, Kaiwa, um, there was a conversation about her being on the show. Like okay. several conversations about that. Mm -hmm. and, and to Kyra's credit, she agreed to do it because she wanted to share her side of the story. And Maurice wanted it to happen. And then Kimmy wanted it to happen. So right. that's the way that I operate. It has to be the collective agreeing to it because I'm not here to disrespect anybody. But let me read what the Instagram page, The Shade Room wrote after they posted these pictures of Ariane and Martel hanging out over the weekend. And then I'm gonna read what Carlos King put in the comment section of this post and then read Ariane's response to Carlos King. So the Shade Room says, okay, Martel Hope from Love and Marriage Huntsville is enjoying his night out with the mother of his child, hashtag Ariane Curry. If you can recall, Martel cheated on his ex-wife, hashtag Melody Holt, with Ariane for several years, which caused their divorce after nearly 12 years. And Carlos King did respond to the post, honey, and said, um, catch Love and Marriage Huntsville every Saturday, 8, 7 Central on OWN. And then he gives his shrugging of the shoulders emoji. Now, Ariane responded to Carlos King's message and said, at the Carlos King, Martel said, where that bag at? Again, honey, hinting that she wants to be on the show. Now y'all know these comments under that post was lit. They were actually on fire and it was too hot for your girl so I had to get out of the comment section. And so honey, I refused to go through every last comment, but here are a few that were posted under the comment that Carlos King originally made. And someone said, at the Carlos King, make sure you question him about him and the peasant at the next reunion, sir. And you know, to be honest with you all, I cannot believe that people are still calling her a peasant. Ariane has had a whole baby with this man. And on top of that, Martel is publicly claiming her now. So I don't know y'all, let me know in the comment section of this video, can homegirl be called by her real name? Another comment said, at the Carlos King, child, we need an episode for this nonsense alone. And another comment said, LOL at Carlos King, y'all better not bring her on the show either. And one more comment said, yes, Carlos, she's giving y'all free promo. The ratings and reviews go up and everyone gets paid except her. 
silly coleslaw tricks are for kids with the laughing emoji so honey before i wrap up this video here is a video of Ariane talking to the people on her instagram page and martel isn't in the actual video but he's in the background even though he doesn't show his face you can definitely tell that he's there or someone is there but from the pictures of the shade room we know that that's him there with, with her in the hotel with her in the car driving to the event and then him being present with her at the concert so make sure you leave your thoughts in the comment section of this video as always thank you guys for watching i really appreciate it and i will talk to you guys okay, in the guys, next video too much i thought he did good too much I think I could have been contoured just a little more snatched, but. Mmm. What y'all doing this Friday night? Y'all must have to a concert. Stand up. Mmm. Stomach is giving a little fat, but let's get into it. Pink and gray. Oh, my nails are pink. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh, do you think this one's good? Is it date night? It's date night. Mm -hmm. It's giving date night. Thank you. Who did my makeup? Um, actually, I did have a girl scheduled, but I didn't make it in time. So I went over to Mac and Linux, and it was a guy there. Um, I need to tag him because he did the good. But the Mac counter, and I took my products home this time because I was paying 185 and washing it off. I took a bag of makeup home. Y'all want to see? Ooh. Come see me. I'm in Linux working. Who are you working at? I was just in there. Hi, Ryan. What wine are you drinking? Martell's wine. Honest. Mm-hmm. It's definitely given. It's his name, Tommy. I don't even know his name. He worked at Mac and Macy's. I don't understand. Thank you. The wine good. The wine is very good. 
Martel did something with this one. Uh huh. Yeah. How's the wine I want to order? Um, the wine is perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. He did a good job on the makeup. I hope you have a great evening, D-Step. Thank you. Welcome to my city again. Y'all enjoy yourselves. Thank you. When is he going to put the wine out for sale? I think it's real soon. Two weeks. Two days. Two months. How was Knox and Pierce doing? Very, very good. Is it sweet or strong wine? It's, it is sweet, but it's very, very good. the perfect blend it's right there in the middle um if you like more dry you'll love this you'll love it i love it BBL surgery hurt. I didn't have a BBL, guys. <laughs> I'm not against it, though. I'm definitely not against it. I just didn't have one. And how is your recovery going? I, I didn't have a BBL, but pretty soon I would like to get my breast done. Tag some good doctors. But I didn't have a BBL. Because it's my life, and that's, that's why. It's my life. You gotta try that wine. Mm -hmm. Perfect blend. Perfect blend. It's not too sweet, it's not too dry. It's right not too sweet, not too dry, right there in the middle. We need y'all on the show. I don't think y'all would be ready. 